when you look at Elon Musk, he seems like insane and chaotic from the outside. But when you integrate things together, you start realizing there's a cohesive picture behind all of his startups. Like, why does he have the boring company? That doesn't make any sense. He's drilling all these tunnels underground. Like, why would he do that? Well, if he wants to go to Mars, humans aren't going to live on the surface of Mars. They're going to live underground. So you're going to have to build massive tunnel complexes underground to be able to go through. Well, why does he have a solar company? Why does that make any sense? Well, you know, he's going to have to be pretty good at building power plants, right? So why don't you build large solar fields because there's no real estate problems on Mars. So you can build like a five-mile solar field on Mars if you wanted to, right? Um, why is he building a robotics company? You know, why, why does he have all these Tesla bots and these types of things? Well, he's, he has all those Tesla bots because, you know, where's your workforce if you're on Mars? You're not going to have five million humans show up overnight, but you can ship millions of robots ahead of time and use them as your labor force to help build up everything, and they don't need atmosphere or any of these other things. Why does he have an AI company? Well, you need some sort of intelligence to coordinate and run and terraform the planet and do all these things. Why does he need a battery power car company? Because you're not going to be running internal combustion engines. There's no, there's no fossil fuels to consume on Mars. So you need battery power cars to be able to drive them around. 